All right. Well, hello there. This is Bourbon Jumbo, and welcome back to WWE 13 and Universe Mode, UWA Universe Mode. I'm your host with the most, Bourbon Jumbo. All right. Anyway. All right. So welcome back, folks, and we are getting started with part 15 of the UWA Universe Mode, and uh. Got some matches set up here for you to give you some good little entertainment today. Got Hunico taking on Jinder Mahal. Portia Perez against Christina Von Eri, who for some reason her name is starred out for some reason. Don't understand that whatsoever, but I'm not going to question it. The Ryback taking on Damian Sandow again. Uh, today's highlight, tonight's highlight match, Sheamus versus the Jimmy Usos. And then in the main event... We have Miz taking on Jack Swagger. So, good little show for you tonight. Let's get this started, shall we? Yes, we shall. Alright, so Jinder Mahal taking on uh, Hunico, the hybrid champion. Currently the hybrid champion. May not be the hybrid champion for very much longer, if I have anything to say about it. Nothing against him, but I'm just trying to figure out what the hell I want to do with that belt. Uh, also, if I can, we might have women's tag team champions, since I have a lot of of women's talent now. You know, I've got I've already did Eve, Nikki, AJ's move sets. So we're 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 working on some shit here. I'm trying to do some different shit, yo. Got a new controller. If you watch my update video, which I hope you did. If you didn't, then screw you. Uh so yeah, we're doing good. <clears throat> Hunico and Jinder Mahal have kind of a storied history. Leading back to the whole uh CWA international title days. Um so yeah, there's some heat here, and gender. Gender's kind of on a roll here, so we're gonna have to get 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 going here. Oh, too late! Damn. Oh no. Okay. There we go. All right. We're off to a good start with this new controller. Punches here. Oh, I already here. Screw loose. It's used, so I don't care. It's probably why the other one didn't work. And I... Oh, no! Yeah, your butthole dislocated. X there. What? There we go. Alright. Get a little side rush and leg sweep here. Good man. Good man. Uh, I'm going to be looking for some community creations, too. Uh, coming up here. Close lines in the corner. It's for some new people, you know, because... I know the shows have been dominated pretty much by the Usos, Jinder Mahal, Superstar J. So, and well, and now Sandow, but I don't mind Sandow because I love Sandow. Can I hit pin? Come on now. Gotta hit it just right. That's stupid. Ugh. Or, excuse me, not just right, but right at the right time. What I think is the right time may not be the right time for the game. So, that's stupid. What the hell? We got another suplex? How many suplexes do you need in your arsenal, dude? Change it up, my man. Change it up. Big pancake there. What we got here? Oh! Big knee drop. And, okay, that didn't work out very well. Ah, reversal! You suck. Well, not really. I'll actually really like Hunico. Poor Hunico. I hope he doesn't get released after, uh... The rumble. I'm trying to get. It. I'm gonna attempt to get tickets to the elimination chamber. Uh Oh shit! I thought he was going in the corner. Fudge nuggets. Yum. All right, time for a uh, Death Valley driver here. Um, like I said, I'm gonna try and get tickets for um the elimination chamber pay per view. But once Rock got uh announced for it, they started flying. There are no four seats left. And I don't know if any of you watching have ever been to the New Orleans Arena, but it isn't. It, there's not a bad seat in the house, but I sure in the hell don't want to sit up in the nosebleed section. Like, I want to be close to that fucking elimination chamber. So, if I can't get some decent seats, then we're not just we're just not going to go. And I hate to say that, because I, I know my little man wants to go, and I want to go, because I've never seen The Rock live. And I've never seen an Elimination Chamber live. So, you know, me seeing a cage match live with Daniel Bryan versus Big Show a few months ago, amazing. I loved it. So, now I want to see the Elimination Chamber. And, uh, I actually have a friend who saw 
uh, a Hell in a Cell match, and he loved it. He said it was an amazing structure. So, you know, we'll we'll, we'll see what happens. Uh, but, of course, if we do go, I'm going to do a uh, huge vlog and just document the trip. So that might be fun. But anywho, all right, so our next match, once it loads here, any day now. The Sunday is the Royal Rumble, of course. I'm really jacked about it. They just announced today that they, during the Fan Fest, uh, eight participant, eight NXT uh, roster people would be getting a would be taking place in a tournament, with the winner getting a spot in the Royal Rumble. It's Adrian Neville, Luke Harper, uh, I forget who else. Those are the only uh, shit. I can't remember. They change everybody's name, so I never remember the names. Uh, Consequences Creed, whatever his... Oh, uh, shit, what is his name? Corey Graves will be there. You, have, you know, you've seen him. Uh, alright, so this match, women's match, there's Portia Perez. That looks much, much, much better than the Portia Perez I had, uh, was using last time. Uh, supposedly has an, uh, a moveset, so we'll see. If not, I'll have to go create it. Entrances, I don't really care about, you know, because I skip them half the time anyway. But movesets are like the big, the big, you know, the big things. And of course I'm going to be Portia. <laughs> Portia is my, my woman. My favorite woman's wrestler in the world. Nobody else will ever come close to Portia. She's just such an amazing heel lover. And I'm not loving her Karanas right now. Hey, kick out there? Okay, good. Just making sure. Why is her head hurting? And a reversal, and go back to the front face lock, and body slam. Excellent, Tessa. Uh, Porsche just got back from a tour of Japan for the Reina promotion. Again with the her. Okay, gotta change the her Karanas. Don't like her Karanas, or at least not like a gazillion of them. And we got ourselves a vertical suplex there. Love it. Love it. Digging it. And some kicks. Oh, now she threw me over. Come on over here, woman. Oh, come on. I guess because she, she wasn't directly in front of me, the block really didn't work. And into the railing she goes. Uh, Portia, of course, is a multiple-time uh, ACW Queen of Queens champion. Uh, she is a former ACW heavyweight champion. She actually held the men's title. She's a former American Joshi. No, she's an American Joshi champion. She's the Queen of Queens tournament winner. Um, speaking of which, we'll be doing the Queen of Queens tournament pretty soon. You know, from my... It's the Queen of the Ring, I guess, pretty much. But call it the Queen of Queens tournament. Um, what else? Uh, the Shimmer, t mul two time Shimmer Tag Team Champion. Uh, so yeah, pretty good. And, ooh. Ah, you butt juggler. Come on, oh, come on. And elbow to the top of the head. And a running Huracarana. Okay, I don't mind those Huracaranas. Those are fine. But let's see what her signature is. Neck breaker. I bet they did not do a finisher. Super kick. Nope, didn't do a finisher. Alright, so. Ooh, why'd she spin around like that? Okay, so I have to fix uh, her finishers. And take out the Huracarana. So I need to make a note of that. Okay. So, her Karanas, and matter of fact, if I have my notebook right here. Oh, I do have a notebook here. I need to write that down because I always forget. Dude, I'm telling you, ever since my car accident, my short-term memory is shit. Like, I cannot remember anything. It's unfortunate, but... Ah, uh, that's my life. I hate it. Well, I don't hate my life, but I hate the fact that my uh, shit's always so fucked up. That's why I always slur my words, because uh, it jacked up my head. Uh... I have like, what do they call it, post-concussion syndrome. 
Like, yeah, that's actually a thing. Like, I have headaches. Like, I have a constant headache. Like, there's always pressure on my head. You learn to live with it, but it's not fun to live with. But, unfortunately, you do learn to live with it. Just so, like, from the front of my head on, there's, like, constant pressure. It sucks. But, uh, alright, so, Portia. Her Karamas. And signature and finisher. I would love to book a promotion. There's actually a promotion that wants me to help. I IWL. Oh, I've given some advice before, but you know. All right, so now we have. I would love to book a promotion. Anyway, uh, first. Uh, get rid of these entrances there so I don't get popped for copyright content. I think Sandow might have been the reason I got a copyright strike last time. Uh, Ryback's been kind of been getting his butt kicked, so let's give him a win back, shall we? Maybe, I don't know. There's no guarantee anyone will walk out of this with their careers intact. Shut up, Cole. I really wish I could turn commentary off. I know you could on the other old games. What's, oh, no, he threw... Oh, shit, man, he didn't even try and catch himself. He just went flying out to the floor. Okay, he wasn't going to do anything, apparently. Headbutt. Down he goes. And... Gutbuster, yes. I hate, 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 hate... Ryback's signature, or no, his his ver not his signature, his version of the uh, shell shock. It looks stupid. It doesn't even look anything like the shell shock. And uh, there we go. And they knew they were putting him in because they did the stupid uh the you know the taunt and everything for him. So, oh come on, you're. Butthole's devastating. Yeah, I have no idea what the hell. <laughs> What's going on here? Big backdrop suplex. Capture card's getting choppy for some reason. What the fuck? Irish whip. And a charge in the corner. There we go. And some stomps to the face, yo. I'm going to do a shit ton of videos for you folks coming up. Little bro has to be difficult and upload his stuff in HD. So it's taking the. Why is he holding his ass on a power bomb? Little little dude, my God, he started recording. He's like, I don't want it in just regular definition. I want it in 1080p. I was like, Are you kidding me, man? No, I want it in 1080p so it looks good. I want my videos to be awesome. I was like, All right. So we spent the entire night uploading and rendering one video. Because somebody had to have it in HD. But it looks so much amazing. Like, I gotta admit. And I... And I would do my videos in uh, 1080p, but... My God. See, look at this! This is so shitty! That doesn't even look like the Shell Shock. Pin um, One! Two! Three! Alright. So, Ryback wins. Uh, he is uh, two for two. Now... Here in the UWA, he's got a damn good move set. I gotta say, he's got some great fucking power moves. Uh, here comes the piggyback stunner. I need to change Superstar J's signature. His uh, he's got the he has the the Sunday Bloody Sunday, and he has the piggyback stunner as his signature. And then of course you've seen his uh, finisher, so I kind of need to change one of his signatures so it won't be so uh. You know, the copying anything. I hate to, I hate to copy too much, but I realize that you know when you come to a video game thing, you gotta have some moves overlap. So unfortunately, you know, this is one of those instances. But we'll have to change that pretty soon here. And uh, my God, my head is killing me today. Whew. Ibuprofen, painkillers, and muscle relaxers and anti-inflammatories with some soda are about to be my uh, my dinner here. All right, so here comes Big Sheamus. Uh, I need to leave this because this is a highlight match. I don't know if something's going to happen. Let's see. 
ibuprofen gel caps. Ibuprofen gel caps, the CVS brand, just as good as the regular brand, I'll tell you right now. And if I can get it on there. And my headache relief pills. Adapex, always interesting. Alright. Ugh. Yuck. I'm gonna take one of these. Y'all watch the entrances and talk amongst yourselves while I uh, do this. It is 4 o'clock, so it's time for everything. Sorry. I know you're probably enjoying listening to me taking my meds. I haven't actually seen the Usos entrances yet, so this will be interesting. Man, why do they make these bottles so fucking hard to get into? My god. And cotton? Really? Do we need cotton in there too? Ugh! It's a big ass thing of cotton, man! How do they do that to. Uh, or something? I don't know. Alright, so I'm just gonna take one of those. Right now, that way I don't get completely obliterated while I'm. <laughs> I'll start sounding like I'm drunk. It's getting to the point where I'm not able to drive very much. I hate to say that. But, uh, I can't, uh, drive while I'm on my meds. Because it knocks me out. And then a pain med. Yay. Jesus Christ. Alright, I'm sorry, folks. This is kind of important if you, you know, I can continue to live. Uh. Alright. Alright, so everything's taken now. Let's see, Seamus or Jimmy Uso? Seamus. Oh, you want to square off against me, bud? Alright, let's see how it is, yo. And a big back elbow to the face. And some punches. Or not. Oh, no. Whoa, shit, man. He just unloaded a butt whipping on me. The Usos are really good on this game. You're about to get posted, bitch. Oh, yeah. That'll teach you to come after... Will you do something for shit? Did he say, did he, did he chase the steal or taste the steal? And some shoulder blocks on the corner here. I know, they sounded like you said chase the steal. Wait, why are you doing... I didn't tell you to do that, you jerk off. God damn it. I wanted him to take the... Uh, it is L1, huh? Ah, you fuck face. I want you to take the freaking thing off. Oh my fucking... Mm, that's what... I should have been... Even with the new controller, this game still pisses me the fuck off. Too many buttons do this uh, different shit. Like, the same buttons do the sa different shit. Alright, Irish whip. Corner. Is it R2? No, R2 runs. Maybe R1? Nope, doesn't work. Oh, well. Off. Oh, forget that. I'll just have to cheat in other ways. And what do we got here? We got a power slam? Just a straight up, up and down power slam. Irish whip, bees, and a big back body drop. And what we got here? Fall away slam? Yep. I like the new fall away slams they did. They're not flying all over the damn ring. And another elbow drop. Up and down we go, yes. And time for a signature. It is going to be the choke breaker. Love it. And what is this? Oh, it's going to be the Razor's Edge or the Irish Curse. This is not the Irish Curse. Okay, maybe it is. Last year he was like, do that flinging one, which was just stupid. I think it was last year he did the flinging one. Go with the pin, asshole. One, two, three. All right, so Sheamus wins. Uh, he got back his uh, win over an Uso after uh, last week's uh, betrayal by Wade Barrett. Of course, the hell in the cell it will be Mr. Barrett against Sheamus. Uh, 
Maybe Randy Orton will be involved in there somewhere. I'm not really sure. And there's the pins, and we're going to skip all this goodness. What's going to happen here? Yep, we got a cutscene coming up. Posing. He's walking out. Oh, he thinks better. He remembers what happened last week. He's going to send a message. Sheamus is getting himself into too many feuds here. He's got to worry about Wade Barrett. Now he's starting shit with the Usos. Better remember what happened. And now we're going to have our main event of The Miz versus Jack Swagger. This will be a contenders match for the TV title. Uh, Miz is somewhat recovering from his feud with the Usos. Swagger is still getting a little bit of momentum back. Uh, so we're going to see what happens here. I don't think Miz really needs the win. I think Swagger could use it more than the Miz. So, I think with that being said... Uh-oh! Randy Orton and Jack Swagger, eh? That's interesting. That, I do need some new tag teams, so why the hell not? Maybe we could do uh, Gender and the Miz versus Randy Orton and Jack Swagger. Alright, here we go. Oh, shit! Well, he knows he's outnumbered, so he's going to charge me at the beginning of the bell. Too late. Yeah, I knew that was too late. All right, Randy, get up there and do your job, bud. Thank you. Appreciate it. McEnroe. Should have been a little bit more devastating than the McEnroe. But I'll take it. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Gut wrench suplex. Or gut wrench suple. Copyright Gordon Sully. 1978. Damn, we got a signature already? I'll take it. That's a... That's one way to do it, I guess. If you want momentum, you put down a former tag champion and, uh... Heavyweight champion. There he goes. He's done. He's donezos. Go for the pin. One, two, and three. Well, Miz, uh, Swagger just picked up a huge-ass victory over the Miz. A quick victory, too. Here he goes with the Blue Thunder Bomb. And then, the pin. All right. Oh, I hit next show. Didn't mean to do that. All right, so we're going to have to back out of that. All right, folks, well, I'm going to go fix that and since I goofed up here. And we will see you next video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at Bourbon Jimbo. You know you want to because you love me. You love my videos. Toodles.